Hi everyone, it's Tiffany. I am back in Disney Dreamlight Valley with our Let's Play. I am starting off in Daisy's Boutique because I finally figured this out. I don't know if it was there all along or if they just added this, but it did have instructions on <laughs> how to complete, where are we going? Right here. Um, how to complete the furniture part of the boutique challenge. Literally, you just edit it like you're editing anything you know like you go into your furniture menu and you just put it in this space here so my challenge had to do with blue bedroom and hats so let's see if i have completed the challenge according to daisy well, look who okay did we complete the challenge i completed it we got a reward of 100 daisy Bye -bye. coins that's amazing now i do need to talk to her Wow, now that's what I call rising to the challenge. You absolutely have to keep expressing your fabulous sense of style, and the boutique will help you do that. I can't wait to see what else you come up with. Now it's time for me to reacquaint myself with the valley and check in with my boyfriend, Donald. I can't wait to see him. Toodles, Tiffany. I'll be in touch. Okay, cool. I am going to speak with her now. Could I get your help with something? It's for Donald. Sure. He sure is happy I'm back, and he's being such a doll. He's even offered to help me get my house back in order. I want everything to be perfect for our housewarming date. I've got this, his favorite snacks, our favorite music. I've even ordered some mochas from Chez, Chez Remy. But Donald's coming over now, and I still need to freshen up. I hate to ask, but could you pick up the mo mochas and bring them to my house? Sure. Thanks, Tiffany. You're the best. Once you get the mochas, please just bring them to my house. Okay. Uh, I just need to talk to Remy, I guess. Can I edit these? Hold on. Sorry. I'm like, I got distracted. I can't edit. How do I edit those? Somebody tell me. Do I need to like go in here? And no, I guess not. That wouldn't work. No. Anyway, somebody tell me in the comments how to edit those. <laughs> All right. We're going to go to Remy because I actually need to talk to him. Part of the new update or the newest update, update 11, was that he we could do deliveries with him now. It's I don't know if it's a quest type situation or what, but let's speak to him. Bonjour. All right, let's go start quest Bon Appetit. That'll be the, or we can finish Trouble in Paradise. Bon Appetit. Ah. Tiffany, you know, you're getting to be a pretty incredible chef. Mm. Feel like you're ready for a challenge? Definitely. Great. I was thinking we could open up some new culinary possibilities by testing your cooking skills each day. And since you're a pro now, I won't be giving you the recipes first. You'll have to figure them out by yourself. Don't worry. I'm not asking you to work for free. If this works, we'll both get rewarded. What do you say, Tiffany? Ah, uh, yes, chef. I'd love some daily cooking challenges. That's great. Now, before we get started, feast your eyes on this. It's an old restaurant menu I found in the stock room. Okay, cool. Okay, that was it. Oh, I gotta investigate it. This is actually cool because I really wanted to do a Let's Play episode where we kind of just went through all of the recipes and kind of unlocked everything because I've, I've been wanting to do that for a while. We haven't done that, so this might be a good opportunity. Anyway, Daisy's mocha order. Uh, how did you know? You could say I felt it in my whiskers. Here you go. Say hi to Daisy and Donald for me. Okay, cool. So we got that for Daisy, and I guess I need to investigate this strange menu. Oh gosh, I need to empty my inventory. Okay, investigating the strange menu. Oh, cute. See, this is what I want to do with my valley area. The mysterious menu that Remy found in the basement of his restaurant. Okay. Whoa, did you see that, Tiffany? When you opened up the menu, all these memories started rushing back. The restaurant used to have a whole seating area around it with tons of tables and chairs and an incredible statue. I knew it. I knew something was missing from the restaurant. That seating area looked amazing. It was. I remember it was all made out of a special extra shiny and durable metal called wrought iron. Mr. McDuck helped me order it, but it cost a whole lot of star coins. That's what we could do for the cooking challenges. The restaurant will be able to make enough star coins to make something as impressive as that seating area by just serving folks in the restaurant. We need to start make, taking mobile orders. Ooh, great idea. Thanks. My cooking may be based in tradition, but I'm all about innovation too. Okay, 
you need to start by getting the word out. Why don't you make some free sample deliveries around the village? And remember, this is a challenge of all your culinary skills, so you'll have to figure out the recipes yourself. Good luck. Uh, cool. I don't really... Oh, okay, he, told, he tells me. I need to bring something with slush ice to Elsa, something dessert to Belle, a meal made with fish to Nala, and a five-star meal to Ariel. That's, like, super basic, right? Unless it's, like, super detailed and I don't know about it. Like, what if the dessert is cookies and I go through all of the desserts and it doesn't work? Anyway. Uh, Daisy. Hey, girl. Um, wait. Oh, Belle's here. But I don't have... Oh, do I have a dessert? Maybe I have a dessert. I do, but I'm using that. Um, I can give her this boba tea. I guess that counts. Does it count? <laughs> I don't know. Hello. Okay. Hello. Remy's starting a secret... A secret service. <laughs> a service in the village for special deliveries. You could order a special dinner for you and Beast. That's a wonderful idea. I'll be sure to order something soon. Now, if only we could get some sort of service like this in the village for books. <laughs> Uh, so, Elsa, Nala, Ariel. Alright, I need to take these things to Daisy. Do I need to go to Daisy's house? I forget. I don't know. Alright, Elsa. Do I have something for Elsa? I do have something with Slush Ice, but I'm using it, so it's not gonna work out. Sorry. Let's just go to Daisy's house and do these mocha things, because I don't want to accidentally, like, use them or whatever. Okay, oh. Goodness, it wasn't like this before. Here are the two mochas for you, Daisy. Well, look who oh, Tiffany, is. you brought the mochas. You're so sweet. Aww. Thank you for bringing them. But as you can see, our housewarming date has been ruined. It was going so well, we were reminiscing, laughing, and then we decided to build this wardrobe together. And then? It all happened so fast. One second, Donald huh? was hammering two boards together. The next he was flying across the room, breaking everything in his path. I'm afraid I lost my temper before I even asked what happened. I just wanted our date to be perfect. He must be pretty mad at me. I have a feeling Donald's more upset with himself. Let me go talk to him, okay? Oh, that would be fantastic. Thank you for being such a good friend, Tiffany. You're welcome. Goodbye. Hey, Donald. Hello. Ah, Bowie. Just look at this mess, Tiffany, and it's all my fault. I bet you came here to laugh at me, huh? I'm only here to help. You are? That's fantastic. You see... Daisy and I were building her new wardrobe, and my hand hit, got hit with the hammer hard. I jumped back, and I tripped on Daisy's toolbox, knocked over the flower pot, spilled everything everywhere. It's a mess, a gigantic mess. Daisy's got to be so upset, I bet she's furious with me. Donald, it was an accident, and Daisy's worried that you're upset with her. Why don't we start fixing this by cleaning up? You'll help me? Oh, boy, thanks. Uh, sure. Okay. Uh, I need to use my tool. What would I use for stains? Water? I guess so. Uh, water? Does it- did it work? Okay, yeah. I was like, it's not going anywhere. <laughs> I wonder if I use my shovel for the other items. We shall see. I can't get through there. Uh, flower pots. I'm gonna- well, maybe it's not pickaxe. It has to be shovel. Uh, shovel. Shovel? Yes! Haha! -ha! Shovel! Just gonna smash them into bits so they're not here anymore. <laughs> All right, and return to Daisy. Oh, okay. Well, I guess we're taking a picture instead. <laughs> Didn't mean for that to happen. It's so the lighting's so weird in here. Um. Anyway, would you look at that? It's spotless. Thank you so much for helping clean up, Tiffany. Now I just need to fix this thing with Donald. I don't suppose you could check on him for me. Uh, sure, I'll talk to him. I just did. Uh, any pointers? Mm -hmm. Try and be gentle. Donald can be so hard on himself. Thank you for everything, Tiffany. You really are a gem. Don't You're welcome. Hey, Tiffany. Thanks for helping Daisy clean up. I just went on a nice date with her building that wardrobe together and then kerpow! I ruined everything. Daisy wants to make up. She does? Hooray! I gotta do something for her. Something special. Maybe a cruise. Or I can plant a field of a million daisies or write her the best love song of all time. Let's start with the wardrobe. Hey, that's a great idea. Let's get started right away. If you round up plans and the tools, I'll get the materials. Oh boy, oh boy, Daisy's gonna be so happy. Come see me as soon as you get the materials for the wardrobe. Yeah, All right, easy enough. Do I need to talk to Donald again? It's saying that I need to talk to Donald again, so I don't. I do not know. Do I? Do I need to? I will wait for it to. Oh no! Oh goodness! Say cheese. 
Lighting is still weird though. Anyway, let's go uh, away. I don't know if I want to complete that today. I think I let's see what we need. It should be fairly simple for the most part, like hardwood, tinkering parts, iron ingots. Yeah, it should be fine. I am going to just kind of we jumped right into it. Let's so let's see what we have for other quests here. So no um, eternity isle, eternity isle, eternity isle. So let's go back down here. So Dreamlight Valley. Dreamlight Valley for Mike, uh, Eternity Isle, and Dreamlight Valley. Oh, yeah, uh, the Remy stuff. And then these are locked just because we need to get to higher levels with everybody else to get those. Um, but, oh, gosh, I completely forgot till just now. We've got to go see the new realm. Unlock the new realm, you guys. What are we doing sitting here? Oh, my gosh. As part of the new update, I was, like, talking about Remy's thing. But, actually, sorry. I've been meaning to take these ears off. I didn't. This was just part of the the the, the Daisy's Boutique thing. I just really wanted to get that done, and then I got distracted. But there's a new realm, and I really should have started this at the very beginning. But up here? No, maybe it's up another level. Yes, we're going to Mulan's realm. Stop. Let's see how much it's going to cost to unlock. To unlock. Okay, 15,000, I almost said moonstones, not moonstones, dreamlight. All right, explore the Mulan realm. Here we go. I'm so excited. I'm so hyped to have our two new friends in the village. Oh my gosh, it's beautiful. All of the bamboo. It's definitely giving me Eternity Isle vibes. <laughs> definitely. Oh my gosh, the cam. It's so pretty. Oh, I love it. Mushu! Oh no, it's the wrong Mushu. All right, let's go see him. I think he's in here. This is cool though. Should I like look for other things here? Maybe I should. I mean, there's some random sticks that are sparkling. Why are they sparkling is the question. Maybe I'll like need them for a quest. <laughs> oh, it just says explore the Mulan realm. Okay, so I'm just gonna pick up all of the sparkling items, I guess. Uh, we have some chests. Oh, this is so cool! Alright, I got furniture there. Should I empty my inventory before this? Alright, we're gonna... Well, is there anything over here? No, nothing in the river. I'm wondering what this is. I don't think I'll need to dig that or anything, but maybe I will. Alright, nothing over here. We can go down this little path here. Well, we were just... Were we not this way a second ago? Maybe. <laughs> I don't know. Oh my gosh, there's so much. It looked like a really tiny area to explore, but now I'm like, oh, well, um, there's quite a bit, actually. All right, that's where we came in, and we're going to continue over this way. We circled around there. My poor sense of direction is not going to help us in this case. We do have flowers there and there, and then let's go down this little path here. There's some more flowers. I don't- this must come back into the camp. Maybe. Oh, gosh, which way do I go? That way goes to camp. This way. Oh my gosh, this just keeps on going. Alright, we got sticks and we've got this chest. Alright. I don't know. I guess we need to pick up all of the sticks and all of the flowers that are sparkling before it like tells us to do something else. That would be what I am going to guess is, is the case. So let's see how much we can get through here. I don't know if that actually goes anywhere. Like, I can't get through there. I could try the tools and things, but I'm going to avoid that for right now. <laughs> All right, I didn't see... Are there sticks over here? No, we're good. And then I don't think there's anything over that way. So let's get this flower. And then this flower... Okay, we haven't, like, progressed there at all. Oh, there is a stick over here. Or maybe, maybe I should just go into the camp. Let me see. Let me see what's going on here. Alright, so we're in here and there's randomly spilt stuff. It's sparkling, but I can't click on anything or whatever. There's ingredients here. Okay. Alright, what are we gonna have to do? Like, I wonder if I should uh, pickaxe all of these. I mean, it's just gonna give us rocks, so it's pretty basic. I feel like I just want to go talk to Mushu and see what's up. Let me see if I can speak to him. Okay. You are in the presence whoa, of whoa, a whoa. legend. Who are you? You know that, right? Me? I'm Tiffany. Nice to meet you. Whoa, Tiffany, how did you 
find this training camp. It's supposed to be hidden, secret, incognito. I get it. You're a spy. I'm not a spy. That's exactly what a spy would say. I promise I'm not. Aha, aha, quiet spy. I know you're a spy because I have a list of recruits who are supposed to train and wait, uh... what's that? There's a name at the bottom of the list. It's smudged, but it could be Tiffany. Okay, okay. You're not a spy, but you're late. Well, what do you have to say for yourself? Uh, yes, sir. I'm sorry, sir. What? Whoa, whoa, whoa. No need to be so formal. I'm just making sure we respect the decorum of the setting. I know you defender types just love protocol. By the way, I'm Mushu. Nice to meet you, Tiffany. Now, I'll go back to calling you recruit. Just play along. You'll be great. Ahem. So, recruit, you missed the Battle of the Rice Cauldron. That marked the end of training. And since you're extremely late, you're going to clean up the camp. Message received, Sergeant Mushu. <laughs> Sergeant Mushu, I like that. Ah, yeah. Now, start breaking up the rocks and digging I up the rice spills. Oh, and don't forget to flip over the cauldron. And okay, remember, cool. Don't be a I am... Can, do I need my shovel? Break the rocks, dig out the rice spills. Okay, flip over the cauldron. I flip over the cauldron. There we go, great. So, break the rocks. I kind of already broke the rocks. What do I do since I've already broken them? Whoops, maybe more of them are here. All right, let's dig up these rice spills. Rice, rice, Oh, that one scared me for a second. All right, we've got 12 rice spills. And uh, let's see, whoops, let's collect that. We've got some more rice spills down this way. And then down this way. Oh, over here. Gosh, I love this camp. It's so cool. All right. Um. Well, did I not just see one there and it disappeared? Never mind. Uh, I am out of food, energy, or whatever. I'm actually going to open these as well. These bags of furniture that I got. So I got this elegant mahogany table. Cool. And this one I got. What did I get? What did I get? A large wooden tub. That's actually really cool. I like that. Okay. Uh, but anyway, food. <laughs> had to make sure I had food. Okay, back to the rice spills. Uh, no more that way. Let me see if I could sneak around this side. Oh, this is nice. I don't see any more rocks. I'm a little concerned. <laughs> I don't know what to do about the rock situation. What if I messed it up? It'll be fine. I'm sure there's some here that I can get. Okay. Let's go here. Nope, I can't get that one. There we go. One more. I see it over here. Let's get that. And then I need my pickaxe back. And then we'll go over here. We've got two more rocks. Alright, done. And then one more rock here. But yeah, I already did two rocks. So what happens now? Did I like just completely mess it up? Why would they let me do that? What do I do? Uh. Okay. Well. What do I do? Like, actually, what do I do? I've already cleaned up the rocks, so. Okay, here's one. Oh, maybe there's more here. Okay. Let me see. There's got to be one more. And then I just missed. Alright, I don't know if it'll be inside the camp either. It says clean up the camp. So I would think it's going to be inside the camp. Uh, let's check again. Let's check again. Oh, yes, okay. That was not there before, so they are spawn- they respawned or whatever. Oh, a chest. Or maybe I just missed it. <laughs> anyway, I gotta return to Mushu now. I'm gonna see what I got in this bag as well. Alright, what do we got? It is a weapons rack. Ooh, we love a good weapons rack. Okay, let's go this way and to Mushu. Hi, Mushu. Let's get this show on the road. Excellent work, Tiffany. I mean- Recruit. <clears throat> the camp looks good as new. Huh. Now, yeah. you can't start your real training until you're properly dressed. There should be a uniform for you around here somewhere. Well, what? parts of it anyway. What do you mean parts? Oh, I think the kids, I mean the, the recruits, were in a hurry to get home and forgot to turn in their uniforms. Don't worry, everything's clean. You just gotta look around for the different pieces. Oh, like a treasure hunt. Love it. Sure, yeah, 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 have fun. You're going to have to look all over the camp and outside it, too. Make sure you find shoes, socks, and a pair of pants and a shirt. Once you find everything, bring them back to me. Okay? See ya. Yeah. So I need to find four items of clothing. Are they in these chests? 
You need the key to access the storage. Oh, okay. Nope, they're not in the chest. I'm not sure what they will look like, but we shall see. I'm going to assume there's not going to be much in the camp because he did specifically tell me to go outside of the camp to look. So we shall see. I'm just going to glide around, see what I can find. I'm really wondering if I need to dig spots. No, okay. Never mind. I'm not seeing anything yet. What do I do? <laughs> Are they here? Hello? Shirts? Pants? Ooh, there's sticks. That's not what we're looking for, though. I don't... Oh, wait! Oh, are they in rocks? Oh, they're, like, on rocks. Okay. So, they're kind of, like, strategically placed, I see. Alright, so we found shoe. We... Need... The rest of the item still. Is there anything on this stump? I don't know. I don't know what to look for, honestly. What am I looking for? Also, do I need to... Do the, no, I don't need to take down those stumps or anything. Did I go this way? Oh, I can't go that way. Interesting. All right, we'll go up this way. Surely there's something hidden over here. No? Okay. What about in the tall grass? No? No? Okay. Right? I... No. Oh, there's something hanging in the tree. Oh my gosh. All right. I wish I was checking these off. I need to know what else I need. I think I need... Wait, I already got the shoes, but it didn't check it off. That's weird, right? Maybe I didn't pick them up or something. All right, well, we're going to continue to look around here because I'm going to find these items. Now that they, I know that they can like kind of be anywhere, <laughs> it, makes, it makes me feel a little bit better. Now, I am confused about the shoes, however. You know, did I pick them up? Like, what happened there? Um, I don't know. Oh. I guess I did I didn't pick them up. Okay, okay, that was the problem. Alright, so I found two items. Great. Um, again, my sense of direction is going to probably fail me in this case because I don't know where I've gone so far. I'm trying to make sure I look kind of everywhere because it can literally be anywhere. We're looking for socks and a shirt, which kinda could be in the trees. Because that's where we found the other things. Maybe? Is this some- nope, that's not anything. Where are these socks? And where is this shirt? I mean, these could very well be in the camp, too. I have looked quite a bit outside the camp. Let's maybe go back to the camp and see if we can find anything in there. Now that I know that they can just be laying wherever. Alright, let's walk around here. This edge. Nothing there. And then we've got a little workstation. Love the workstation. Guess I'll go this way. Nothing. I'm like wondering if it's going to be draped around the tent or if it's just going to be laying on the ground. There's a sword. Uh, weapons rack. Not really what I'm looking for here. Man, these are, these are hidden quite well, I must say. <laughs> Where are they? Okay, don't see anything there. Did I miss something? I don't think there's anything in the camp. But I also, whoop! Open storage. Ah, we got the training shirt. Okay, so we're looking for socks. Now that's interesting, because it kind of like started sparkling when I went close to it. So maybe I need to go closer to all of the tents. <gasps> yep, that was it, okay. They got me on that one. All right, so I need to bring this training uniform back to Mushu. I also need to get some more food in my system because I used all of that energy looking for those items. There you go. There's the outfit that you're probably going to make me wear in a second. So I don't know why I'm just giving all of these to you because you're probably going to give them road. right back. Right. Take these. Put them on. I knew it. I knew it was going to make me do that. Why? At least he put it into a single outfit for me. All right, so I need to try it on. Great. Ooh, cute. All right, I'm wearing it. I'm wearing it. I'll wait for the quest to kind of refresh. This is so cool. Oh my gosh, look. I could take a picture where he's like in my hand. That's perfect. We love that. We love that. <laughs> oh my goodness. I love Mushu. I'm glad he's in the, well, about to be in the valley. All right. 
Here I am. Let's take a look at your recruit. Hey, that is, you know what? This is actually nice. You look great, Tiffany. Now, I hope you're ready for the next challenge because it's a doozy. You're gonna prepare Mulan's breakfast. That's great, I love cooking. Then you'll have lots of fun with this. This breakfast is my own personal creation designed to give you energy and put a smile on your face. Here's the recipe. Okay, it's a book. I really need to clear out my inventory. Once you've made it, just ring the gong next to Mulan's tent. That girl was flat out exhausted after training all those recruits. Okay. You'll find all the ingredients you need in camp over by the cauldron. Okay. I'm cool. I'm ready. I love cooking. Well, not in real life, but... <laughs> Alright. Let's see what we're going to be cooking up. Are we okay? Okay. I don't know what the ingredients are. Cool. I guess I need to go in manually and find it. Or I could just do this. I'll just do this. Uh, Wait, where's the cooking area? Is this it? Where do I where do I prepare food? Where do I prepare food? Over here. Okay. Wait, no. <laughs> Wait. <laughs> where do I prepare food? Um This looks like where I would prepare food. Prepare a bowl of food. Okay. It's clearly I'm missing something. Maybe it's in the work table. Oh wait, isn't Mushu by a uh yeah, he's by a fire pit. That's where I that's where I cook it. Okay. I'm gonna check here to see what it entails. So, wait, it's not under quests? Is it under regular stuff? M. Mooshoes. Is it Mooshoes? No, I thought it was Mulan's. I'm confused now. No, it is Mooshoes. Okay. Oh gosh. Anyway, uh, let's go back and see. M. L. M. N. Okay, Mooshoes. So we need. I think we need one of everything. I should have just went and got one of everything because it's going to leave my inventory when I leave the realm anyway, so. Alright, I'm just going to get one. Okay, I got two of that. I'm getting two, I guess. Because we can't do more than that many ingredients, I'm pretty sure. Alright, we need to ring that gong after this. So let's go ahead and prepare the Mushu's breakfast. Let's see, here it is. Auto fill. Great. Perfect. We love it. Looks delicious. Not a new recipe, surprisingly. Alright, ring the gong. Here we go. Gong. Ooh. Oh, goodness. <laughs> Hi. Huh? It's me. Tiffany. <laughs> it's just me. Huh. Who oh. <laughs> Awkward. All right, hey Mulan, hey girl. Have some breakfast. You're tired, you need to sleep, or oh. you need to eat. Oh, this is a surprise. I didn't expect anyone else to be here, but Mushu assures me you're a late recruit and not a spy, which I'm sure is the conclu conclusion he just jumped to. Anyway, welcome to our training camp, and thanks for the breakfast. It looks delicious. Now we've got a lot of work ahead of us. I hope you're ready. Born okay. ready. <laughs> Great. Enthusiasm is always welcome. We have two main things to accomplish. Training you and making sure our defenses are ready for anything. Mushu's in charge of bolstering our defenses and I'll be tra your training guide. You can start by helping Mushu while I eat my breakfast. I'll be ready to start in just a bit. Goodbye. All right. I guess we gotta go help Mushu do some more things. Let's go see. Talk to Mushu. Hey, sir. Let's get to show on okay, the road. okay. I'm gonna drop the Sergeant Mushu stuff so we can just talk. Because I'm telling you, Tiffany, I have a lot to do. We gotta come up with a defense system that'll make any invaders who attack China turn around and amscrite. Do you have any idea of what you want to do? I don't. See, I'm more of a personal guardian and not much of an all of China guardian. I want something that'll strike fear in the mind of any invader and pride in the heart of any defender. Something real impressive. Why not a dragon army of statues with you as the model? Uh, you're fierce enough. True, I am fierce. Let me think. 
Yes, a dragon yeah. army is perfect. And it won't be that hard. We can find everything we need right here. Some firewood as a combustible, some camp mud, and buckets of water to make the dragon statues. Plus, I saw some red spider lilies and chrysanthemums, and that'll make pretty nice paint. Huh. It's just too bad that dragons won't breathe fire like I do. You know, I might be able to help with that. You could? That would be amazing, incredible, epic. Wait, how are you gonna do that? Let's just say I have a magic touch and something called dream shards. All you'll have to do is breathe fire on the statues when they're done. Uh, well, look at you. Everything's under control, recruit. I'm impressed. How long do you need me to pose and capture my likeness for these things? Three hours? Five? Just a couple of seconds. What? I'm going to take a picture of you, Mushu. I've got this little machine that makes instant portraits. I'll show you. We'll catch up later. Oh, I'm already holding it. Okay, so I got to take a picture of Mushu, which I technically already did. But we're going to do it again. Look at that. He's so cute. <laughs> okay. So red spider lilies. We didn't get all of those. We got almost all of them. I must have missed one. Which is crazy because I've been everywhere. Now the camp mud. I don't know. Oops. No. I guess we use the shovel. Okay. Ooh, nice. I was going to say, how are we going to get 50 buckets of that stuff? Turns out each pile has five. So that's great. All right. So we're walking down this path first. I guess we need to keep an eye out for the flower. I'm a little concerned about the flower though because I really do feel like I should have seen it by now. But I don't know. I guess we'll see. I guess we shall find out. I'm going to keep an extra eye out. Um, What else are we looking for? Buckets of water. Okay. So camp mud and buckets of water. Great. We can't go down this way. Camp mud. Let me go up here. I feel like I should leave all the camp mud on the ground just so I know where to look and where I've been. I know, but <laughs> it'll help with my poor sense of direction. Again, I'm still trying to look for this flower that we may or may not be able to find. All right, I feel like I can't leave these behind. It's fine. I've covered most of this area over here. We got buckets of water. We got, oh, there's a flower. Okay. Thank goodness I found that. That's what I was most worried about. All right, so now we just need to find two more buckets of water and some more mud. And I'm obviously not worried about the mud because that is everywhere. And we're already on a good uh, path. All right, so let's keep an eye out for these buckets. I feel like I'm, they're pretty obvious, I would say. Oh, there's one over there. How do I get over there? Wait. Oh, I can walk through that way. I see. I see. All right, well, let's make sure we get all of these first, these buckets. Um, no buckets, or these buckets. I mean, they are buckets can't, of mud. Well, they're not buckets of mud. <laughs> There's a bucket of water. So I just need five, ten, sorry, ten more of the mud. And I already know where the last bucket of water is. So I just need to find one more mud pile, which is right here. How about that? We did pretty well. I Like I said, I was most worried about the water, or the, sorry the flower so we have succeeded all right let's get this bucket of water and i shall go back to oh wait we're missing one camp really one camp mud darn it <laughs> i must have not picked one up hopefully it was this one yes okay hold on i need to oops i need to replenish my food here all right, I just missed one. That was my bad. All right, now we're good. So we need to craft the unfired dragon statues. We need to make 20 of them. Goodness gracious. All right, we are here. Let's do, are they in the functional items or the furniture? Furniture. All right, we need to make 20 of those. Boom. Look at that. Success. And then return to Mushu. Let's get to show on Tiffany, the road. those dragon statues are phenomenal. You are one talented artist. You're too kind. Hey, you deserve it. You did a very impressive job. And I know they'll look even more ferocious once they've been fired. You just need to put the unfired dragon statues and the firewood in the kiln and I'll light it up. See ya. Okay, over here. And let's go boom, boom, and light it up, Mushu. Uh, yeah. We're good to go. Thanks for your help, Tiffany. Now it's time to get this fired up. No, really. I'm going to breathe fire now. Stand back. <laughs> okay. 
All right, we have to wait. I can't wait to see the final result. Ooh, me too. But this is gonna take a while. Why don't you go see Mulan and finish your training while these things set fire? Are they all gonna be like laid out on here? That'd be pretty cool. All right, well, the next thing will be to, uh, oh, of course, wait for the dragon statues to be fired and complete Mulan's training. But I think I am going to go ahead and end this episode here and we'll be back to finish the Mulan stuff. If we didn't do the Daisy stuff, we probably would have finished it. But Maybe not. Maybe it'll take a while. I'm not sure how long this will take. Anyway, if you'd like to become a channel member to unlock exclusive bonus members only videos like our weekly dream snaps challenge videos, you can join by clicking the link in the description or the join button down below. I want to thank you guys so much for watching. Be sure to subscribe and I will see you next time.